Hello everybody on YouTube. So this is the latest on the Alice Chambers Chambers DG tractors. And uh, <coughs> this one here, I think it has a jammed clutch. And uh, let's gotta dig into it a little more. So the uh, clutch lever is laying down here. Actually the linkage is off. But the motor spins. It spins freely. So uh, it's not hopeless. So this this one was an unusual one here. This one has was supposed to have no hope whatsoever. And uh, I had to clean the cylinder off if it works yet. Find out. And he was gonna. And the person I bought uh, from was going to use it for parts, make one good one out of the two bad ones here. So I looked at it and uh, it, it definitely had a seized up motor. So I uh, I dumped uh, diesel fuel into the spark plug holes and penetrating oil and uh, used motor oil. I mean, I, I just kept dumping oil into these spark plug holes, just kept dumping it. Let this sit for a while, and then yesterday I decided to hook it up to my my uh, bucket loader tractor, and I put it in gear and uh, I tried to to pull it, and uh, hopefully it, with that in gear pulling it, it would it would turn the motor. Nope, that didn't happen. I pl I I dragged this thing all over the property. You can see the tracks here. I must really look funny doing it. Look at the tracks all over the place. It would not unseize the motor. So I, I, I guess the owner that had these tractors was right. The, the motor is really seized up. But he told me it was seized up from sitting around. So I thought one more, one more try. So yesterday I, I removed the top part and the, the head and uh, uh which by the way these motors are very easy to work on very simple it's like a lawnmower motor it's a small four cylinder motor anyway i unbolted the whole head put all the bolts back where they belong and i took it off <clears throat> and guess what i put the wrench on and look at this it works it turns all i did was take this board here and i put it in the cylinder whacked it a few times in each cylinder like this with a hammer and it loosened it look at that it's it's gonna work everybody this is so interesting look at that i can turn it all the valves lift. See the wrench on the back here again. Look at that. I, I'm going to clean this up. All the valves are all coming up and down. This is amazing. They said that they, the owner said this this motor was hopeless. It was all seized up from sitting around. Look at it. Everything's working. This is exciting, everybody. So that's all I did. And you know what? I'm looking at the cylinders and they're not scored. I believe we got a motor ready to be fixed up here. Look at that. All the valves are turning up and down. All right. I'll just turn his valves, make sure they're closed. I don't want to leave them open. Okay. Well, maybe I won't be able to do that. I don't know. Let's see here. So anyway, everyone, this is the latest on the Alice Chambers G tractor here. The tractors. Look at that. All working. Okay. I'm going to 
get a new head gasket and and seals uh, for this head. This is just a, a four cylinder fly head, very simple to work on. <clears throat> That's it right there. I had to get the electrical components. I'm trying to find a uh, starter for it. It's missing the starter. That only has a starter on it. Like this, this motor is more complete. <clears throat> but it's not not too big deal. This one has a good clutch on it. So everyone, stay tuned. This is going to be exciting. For now, I'm just going to put this, slip this on there, for now, and uh, <clears throat> just to keep the weather out because it is stored outside. And uh, stay tuned. I'm going to order some parts now for it. I'm going to either make a wire harness for it or I'm going to buy one. I know they're out there. They're not too expensive. So this is the Alice Chambers G tractor with the cultivators on. And uh, here's the clutch. Still works fine as far as I know. Not hopeless everyone. I got two tractors, I'm going to fix them both up and uh, take it from there. Alright everybody, thought I'd just show the latest on the blueberry farm here. There's the blueberries way back there. And uh, stay tuned if you'd like to see more on the restoration of the Alice Chambers G tractors. Let me know. Hope you're enjoying this video. And uh, stop by again for more on the G tractors. That's it for now. Till next time. Well, stay tuned. All right, bye for now. Oh, and don't forget, please like, share, and subscribe. It's important. Let's me know you're enjoying these videos I'm doing. Okay, bye everybody.